Hello guys and welcome to another episode of Dirt's Backyard Garage. We will be shooting in 4K video for all of our videos from now on. And before we get started, I just wanted to say, if you want to fast forward to a certain point in the video for all of my videos, there is a timestamp in every video's description. So if you want to see acceleration, you can just move on to that. If you want to skip the intro, you can move past that. With that being said, let's start taking a look at the 1939 Ford flathead pickup truck. Let's go ahead and take a look at the motor. So the way that you open these guys up is you turn the hood ornament sideways and then you lift up, pop it up. I need to, uh, there's no hood holder to keep the hood up. So I need to place a PVC pole that we use in order to keep the hood open. So this is a Ford Flathead V8. It is something similar to what would come in the car. We have done an alternator a six volt alternator conversion on this it has the two single barrel carburetors new battery upgrade for more power space it has an electronic fuel pump over here with the gauges that you can see that read fuel pressure and it has been converted from the crank starter to an electronic starter so i'll go ahead and give it a starter for you guys now all right guys i'm going to try and do this here while holding the camera, but this is probably the hardest car I've ever started in my entire life. So first what you do is you turn the key on here, turn this switch the, to on, pull the electronic fuel pump here, pull the choke out here, push the clutch in, and then of course push the start button, which is way over here to start this thing up. And then you have to man manually adjust the choke, of course which is great. All right guys, let's go ahead and back it out. Take it for a spin. So one of the funny things about this car is that you're only able to use the first and second gear. One and two. It is a three speed, but because first gear is so low, you're not actually able to use it inside the car. Here's pretty much how much power we have, ready? That's to the floor, which is not that bad actually without having a vacuum advance. Another really cool thing about these old trucks is that down here, I don't know if you can see it, but on this gauge is actually a mercury thermometer because they did not have the electronic thermometers that you see nowadays. We did put a six volt oil pressure gauge in it so we know if we're getting oil pressure. And this thing just, it rides horribly. It is rough, it bounces. When you take a turn, it feels like the whole thing is gonna fall over on its side. But that's just how it was back in 1939. So right here, I'll show you what first gear looks like on this thing. it that's five miles an hour so just absolutely horrible this thing is extremely difficult to drive another cool thing about these old trucks is that they have this vent window here so you can actually open up the windshield to get fresh air in just like this and then this lever down here opens up the floor vents so surprisingly during the summer it actually stays extremely cool in this car this thing also has a windshield wiper, but it is unfortunately a crank. So you would have to twist this by hand if you ever wanted to drive this in the rain, which I would probably not recommend doing. All right guys, we're back home. This has been the 1939 Ford pickup. I really hope you all enjoyed it. Make sure if you want to see more of this stuff, 
hit the subscribe button. I'll be posting about two videos every single week. So with that being said, I'll see you guys next time on Dirt's Backyard Garage.